Francesca here coming to talk to you about the Colour Potential cards again. As you can see, I'm doing another reading for my glamorous assistant, also known as my husband Phil. What's the issue today? Well, um, there, there's a sort of divide in our family. Me and one child, and you and another child, and me and one child tend to uh, press on with life. Uh, <laughs> failing to tidy up behind ourselves, leaving leaving kind of stuff, oh, I'll put, I'll put that away later, I'll put that away later. And uh, the other part of the family, which is yourself and the other child, uh, tend to like to preserve order. So when, when you turn back to where you've been, you know where everything is and everything's available. Whereas I t tend to find Revolutionary. Quite, I tend to find, I, I spend a lot of time trying to find the thing that I buried under lots of other stuff. Uh, a couple of hours ago, or days ago, or weeks ago. So it's an interesting one, and uh, you know I've got through 71 years reasonably well, but I, I know I have spent a long time fight, f trying to find things that uh, I, at the time, am wishing I'd put back where they belonged. So it's worth worth looking at, I think. Not looking at just for the last year, the <laughs> twilight of my existence. <laughs> Less less energy spent trying to find things I thought I knew where they were. Yes. <laughs> when I die, he's going to live in a house that never has the blinds up, that never has the windows open, and, he, the, and he's he, going to gradually drown. But you've only got to put the blinds down again and shut the windows, so you know. Uh, in case. Why not leave well alone? But anyway, yes. Right. Well, you said you'd like to do a more of less of. Yes, I think, I think they're quite useful readings, actually. So this is going to sound a bit strange. We haven't done one of these before. Uh, but we pick a card for what you need to do more of for this issue and less of for this issue. Uh, which sounds a bit odd because as I've banged on and on about it, um, these cards are all positive. So it's the thought of doing less of, but it can work. And it's something our family have done for several years at Easter. I love Easter. Being an art history student, I love um, the resurrection. So we would do it for the year ahead, more or less off. So this is what we're going to do today. Hopefully the less off card will work. Sometimes they're a bit tricky to see. Hopefully you'll get the order card. <laughs> My favourite! Nah. Not for less off though. Oh dear. Nah. That yeah, that's certainly what dreadfully. Get. Yes. <laughs> more fun, less order. Okay. Thank you very much. So this is more of more of what you need to do more of for the chaos issue. Well, I don't know about chaos, darling. I think we're just 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 putting things back where they belong. Okay. More of more of and less of. Yeah. That one. Yeah. Okay. It's interesting how they call you, but anyway, there you go. Yeah, they really do, don't they? Right, can't wait to see what this is. More of. More of. <laughs> More groundedness. Yes. Brown. Yes. Because I don't have the patience, generally, I don't have the patience to ground myself and just put things away or you know keep things in an orderly fashion because I'm too busy flying on to the next thing I want to do. So that makes enormous sense to me uh, and, and, and it's, it's very much a choice I think because it's not my natural thing to do. My natural thing is to, to run on to the next thing that I'm trying to do or the next stage of what I'm trying to do and just remaining grounded using something putting it back in the right place rather than saying, right, bang, on to the next thing. That is not something I'm, I find easy to do. And it's sometimes quite a difficult choice because I don't want to lose my impetus. Okay. And, uh, and I, I fear my, well, some, something in me fears loss of impetus if I, if I just keep rather soberly keeping things in order. Soberly. Soberly. I was trying to find the, the, that's the word that came to me. Not that I'm drunk with activity, but soberly trying to, trying to just, just 
keep things in order. Did they give me a very sober then? Oh, wildly sober, darling. <laughs> Apart from evenings and weekends, of course, with various, a different matter. But, uh, but yes, you, you, I think you, you, your needs are different to mine, and mine, uh, uh, you need this order. I don't need it at the time. I, I sure as hell need it later on when it's too late. But what I need at the time is to get on and do the next thing. And uh, what you've said to me in the past about this issue, which of course we've never addressed in our 40, 49, no, it's, it's feels never like come, 49, 29 it's years never come up. It's never come up at all, um, is that you'll put it away in a minute. Yes, I put it away when I've got the time, when I've finished doing what I'm doing. But by which time I turn around and there's this devastation of stuff, <laughs> which I think, oh, fucking hell, I'll put it away. Pardon me, I'll put it away another time. Yeah. Uh, I'll put it away later. I'll yeah. go have a cup of tea first. Yeah. So groundedness, that's interesting because you're pretty ungrounded in general. You're forever tripping up curbs and you have your head up like this. Well, I'm looking where I'm going. I'm yeah. not wandering around looking at the floor for curbs. I mean, that's, that's, I, 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 I don't necessarily agree with that. But, but, uh, on the other hand, bitter experience suggests that I do occasionally trip over what's at my feet. So if we think more about this groundedness, you come in, uh, it's papers are really bad, aren't they? You're putting papers away. Oh yeah. I, I, and yeah. the man drawer is yeah. just, it just grows like topsy. Um, so anything- I've now got three. <laughs> so, if you think of this groundedness, so think of an example, give us a little example of you not putting things back where they are. You're, you've come in from somewhere. Well, the thing that's coming up, I'm about to make myself a, 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 a kind of bed sofa. Because I've got this idea in my head. So when I'm doing something of a DIY nature, I haven't done a lot lately, but when I am doing something, I'm forever losing track of my tools. That's true. I put them down, I drop them down while I'm thinking of something else, and I'm over there and I'm looking around for this, where is the, where is the thing of me? And it's over there somewhere, probably was underneath something. And I can spend 10 minutes trying to find the thing of me. And if I was a bit more organized in how I dealt with my thing of is, I would just, it would be just there. And that's a reasonable ambition, I think, particularly since I'm about to get into the world of DIY again, after a bit of a break. I would, that would be a bit of a project. That would be a, a good, a good uh, project in which to practice groundedness and just not losing tools as I go. And quite a heavy incentive. Yeah. Because that... filing papers away, not such a great incentive. No. But to be able to find your tools so that this job is less frustrating yeah. and quicker. Yeah, absolutely. And I've noticed when you are under stress, you get really ungrounded, yes. which is really dangerous yes. when you're using power tools, etc. So this is, this is, yes. yeah, this is a, this is a really important one for this particular project. I think yes. that's a great project to choose. It is. So how are you going to feel grounded? How are you going to remind yourself? How are you going to think of that dark brown? feet on the ground. Well, the colour the color is, uh, I might have the card up there actually, that might be a good That'd idea. Be a good idea. Uh, the colour the color itself is very helpful. The wood is going to be brown. True. Uh, although not as dark brown as that. And... Um, Feeling your feet on the ground. Yes. Is always the quickest get through with groundedness, to feel your feet on the ground. Yes. Because it just yes. centres your energy again so that you're not... Aah! You know, onto the next thing, onto the next thing, but you've got your feet on the ground and you're going to put your screw driver, driver, whatever it is, yes. in its proper place. Yes. Yeah? Yes. Does that feel good? It does. It does. It feels quite promising. Well, I can't wait to see what less of is going to be. <laughs> Don't be ordered. Don't be ordered. Oh, I'm sure it will be. It's not like that. <laughs> yeah. We well, have to show people. It is silver and it is trust. Yes. This absolutely speaks to me, but uh, yes. we'll let the customer uh, go no, first. No, well, the customer, what the, what the customer gets from this is, it'll be all right on the night. Oh, I'll find it. Oh, it'll be fine. I'll, oh, oh, you know, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll sort all that out. I'll, you know, I'll better find my screwdriver in 10 minutes without any trouble at all. Because of course I, I know where I put it. It was yeah. over there somewhere. Yeah. Uh, 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 yes, so if I'm, more skeptical about, or cynical, about my uh, ability to remember where I put things and to uh, 
uh, not cover them with something else while I'm busy doing the next thing. Yes, if, if I if I have less faith in uh, things working out, and I, I, I'm more deliberate about how I go about things. Yeah, I think that is actually that is brilliant. That isn't is it? that is the word I was looking for. That is brilliant. That is a, a card that. You know, we all want a bit of trust. It's a lovely card. It's yeah. a nice colour. But actually, on this occasion, this is what I want more of. And trust is silver. And it's silver because of the moon. And to do with the moon going in cycles and always coming back to its same place. And the moon is up there. If we think of this literally, the ground is down here where your feet need to be. The moon is up there. You've got your head in the stars yes and you need your head and your feet on the ground really knowing what you're doing and, and I, knowing where everything is and i want to be able to find it when i need it rather than a month later <laughs> which is actually oh that's where it is which is actually we hear that a lot in that does life. happen oh yeah here it is <laughs> um so yes yes i think i think that is uh, another very useful reading from the color potential card Okay, well thank you for joining us in colour.